Hi guys, now this is my tropical office. Uh, come here every day. Just had a beautiful Korean chicken wing meal and uh, coconut with ice water. And um, basically we're going to talk about a certain predator today. And this guy is going to get his comeuppance on the weekend on my live stream. I'm going to basically give this guy, well deliver an effective blow to this guy once and for all. He is unrepentant, uh, he's a Mr. Cruel. He uh, basically basically humiliates and does nasty things to children and puts it on camera, a lot of the stuff. There's stuff we don't know of that is, uh, hasn't got on camera. And so we're going to, we don't want to continue to expose this guy. He's been exposed by me about 10 months ago I did quite a few video, a couple of videos, live streams on him. One went for about eight hours and uh, Andy Omar's done a lot on him. Now the bad news is this guy has created more predators and this is what happens if you don't do anything about this sort of stuff. You got, you're going to have more YouTubers basically running the same sort of content and what does this do? It attracts predators. They see this stuff. They lick, lick their lips, these predators, and think, wow, look how close these guys are getting to these young Filipinas. And then they come over here to the, well, to Southeast Asia, and basically they do whatever they do. So it's not gonna, we're not gonna put up with it anymore. The, the other thing being, what happens to the Western blog, uh, expats, they're going to be attacked, they're going to be looked at bad by Filipinos and Thais or whatever from whatever country in Southeast Asia where this is carrying on uh, because of these vloggers and then they get targeted. Uh, you just don't know what's going to happen to them. Recently a, a guy in Cebu, young American guy, was murdered. He got shot. Uh, he was doing allegedly um, doing something with gals, they were overage girls in a nightclub, but that's overage girls, so you're really uh, playing with your, your life if you're going with un underage gals, and basically if you're promoting it, that's a hundred times worse because you're creating them, right? you're creating them. It's just like Rick A was with his bachelor course, and we know what that was all about, horrific stuff. If you don't know about his bachelor course, go to Andy Omar's channel. You'll see parts of his bachelor course on there. It's horrific. So we're going to expose this guy and deliver an effective blow. Well, we're not. We've already exposed him. Did last week, and and I, as I said, ten months ago, I did a big uh, live stream on him and another live on him. And these other YouTubers are now following his lead. As I said, if you don't take action, the disease spreads and then eventually it's going to come and bite all expats on the ass. That's what happens. And you've see, seen what happened a few years ago, about two or three years ago, when the Deputy Prime Minister of Thailand basically came out and said he hates uh, Western expats. He hates them. If it, if it was in his power, he would ban them. Uh, from coming to the Philippines altogether. So that's only a step away from this stuff actually happening where people do get banned or they put massive restrictions on the numbers of Western expats because, well, I suppose there'd be Arab and other nationalities too that are engaged in this sort of stuff, but I think uh, it's mainly these Western uh, dudes. So, um, we're not going to put up with it anymore. We're going to take action. We're going to basically give it, as I said, an effective blow. We're going to show it on the live stream, 11.30 Sunday morning, Philippines time, on my channel. And we're going to expose the the other two cl uh, clowns that are, are following the lead on this, uh, this predator. And they're showing their predatory um, talents as well, quote unquote. And we're going to expose the enablers, the, the YouTube channels that are enabling this to happen. So thank you for watching. Thank you to Andy Omar for 
basically exposing the sky as well. Good on you, Andy. And I just want to say this guy is unrepentant, this predator. He was on <coughs> Andy's channel this morning. Andy did a live stream about him this morning. And basically he was under multiple different accounts um, pretending he was uh, supporters of himself, this uh, predator guy. He was on Andy's live stream in the chat. And yes, we're gonna, he thinks it's all funny. Um, wait until you share a cell with World Zoom and Barry Jordan. You'll see how funny it is. Thank you. Thumbs up. See ya Sunday.